Density as a conversion factor. The mass of fuel in a jet must be calculated before each flight to ensure that the jet is not too heavy to fly. A 747 is fueled with 173,231 liters of jet fuel. If the density of the fuel is 0 0.768 gram per cubic centimeter, what is the mass of the fuel in kilograms? The information that we're given is that we have a volume of jet fuel that is 173,231 liters. We also know that the density of the fuel is 0 0.768 grams per cubic centimeter. What we're asked to find is the mass of the fuel in kilograms. In our conceptual plan, We have to take into account that we're going to start this problem with the metric volume unit liter and need to relate this eventually to a mass. In order to accomplish that, We'll first convert liters to milliliters, which we can relate to cubic centimeters, which we find in the density that will allow us to get to grams, and the larger mass unit kilograms. We will label the conversion factors or relationships A, B, C, and D for the four steps in this calculation. Let's list the relationships. The first of these will allow us to convert from liters to milliliters. And we know that we have one milliliter equal to 10 to the minus 3 liter. The second conversion factor, B, is that one milliliter is the same as one cubic centimeter. Relationship C allows us to go from a volume to a mass and that employs the density. Density is 0 0.768 grams 
per cubic centimeter. And our fourth conversion factor is that a kilogram is 1,000 grams. So we are ready to solve the problem. Starting with our volume, 173,231 liters. We apply the first conversion factor that one milliliter is the same as 10 to the minus 3 liters. Liters cancel. Second factor is that one cubic centimeter is the equivalent of one milliliter. Milliliters cancel. Now we employ the density. That says that we have 0 0.768 grams for every cubic centimeter of fuel. Cubic centimeters cancel. And now we will convert to the larger unit, the kilogram, and we have a kilogram being equivalent to 1,000 grams. The answer, after correct rounding, is 1.33 times 10 to the fifth kilograms. As always, we want to check to make sure that our answer is logical. The units are correct, and the order of magnitude of the mass, 10 to the fifth kilograms, is the same as that of the volume, which can be ri written as 1.73231 times 10 to the fifth liters. Since the density is fairly close to 1, the mass in kilograms should be comparable to the volume in liters, and it is. So 1.33 times 10 to the fifth kilograms is the correct answer.